Alright, we'll leave them up. Oh! Good thing I had some situation awareness there, huh? Two for one. Almost another two for one. What's up, what's up, Gaming Wars? Welcome back to another episode of Imper Rediscovering Imperion with Chief Rocky. Alright, so we are back where we left off at the Polaris Firebase, and I looked this word up. Canine Dan. Canine Dan. So, I, that is the way I've seen it. Uh, it's very similar to a, apparently an Indian name. Uh, so, Canine Dan. So we gotta find this guy. Can we can we pick this? Oh no, see it's gonna change the reputation. So we need to go find this dude. Let's go ahead and get that done. There he is down there. K9 Dan. Do we have anything to trade with this dude? We have liquors. Do we really want to sell it though? I don't think so. I got rockets. Can I get a rocket? Ooh. Wait, no way. Okay, anyhow. We need to go find this dude. Let's go find him. They said he was really, really loud. He's talking to this guy here. This is absolutely unacceptable. Unacceptable, huh? This is profiteering. This is... Say hello. Ah. Good, you are here. Can you please tell this formidable person of a... That every sane warrior will never defile the tombs of an elder. Just for fetching some forgotten up things. This is insane. What is actually the problem? The problem? These alleged archaeologists have not only defiled a holy place, but they also ran away like cowards, leaving behind the only thing worth the hassle as soon as the minor problems turned up. Now they are refusing to bring back what I sent them to look for, although they were paid, pretending I would have had tell them about the dangers. A century old technical artifact incredibly important for us and they ran away do you believe that so you paid them to defile a holy place without telling them the whole story well I might maybe but that is not what this is all about I need to get that technical artifact I was told some warrior from the Terrans will come and help my people helped your people over in the uh, Elon system when they had to flee from the Xerax. Hmm. Strange coincidence. This was exactly a year ago. Anyways. Well, you help me or are you a coward as well? I will help you. Great. Your task is simple. Go down to the catacombs of the Elder Tomb and find the technical artifact left behind in one of the cargo boxes. Um, and make sure that you're well prepared. It might be dangerous down there. No worries. Okay, we have a mission. Finally. The buried chamber. Okay. Uh, I don't... Can we access this? Yes, we can. But can I access this? Yes, I can. Ooh, veggie burger. We're going to take that. Um, Teal up. Got plenty of O2. Uh, I like this base, by the way. Can, nope. If we access that, we are done for, son. Okay, we don't want to go outside. Let's get our harbor vessel. Which I believe is upstairs. Can we access that? Nope. Can we access that? Nope. <laughs> can I access... Oh, hold on. I can't, but there's nothing in it. Okay. Um, yeah, I believe we got to go upstairs. Yes, because... Yes, we do. And right here is where our vessel's at. All right. Let's go get this done. I think it's turning dark. So we'll get there, camp out, until it turns light. Uh, there's still plenty of sunlight. We should be good to go. Let's get there first and see how it looks. It's not very far away. Found an iron deposit. That's good. Buried chamber. Ooh, look at this place, dude. For reals, for reals, though. Alright, we're going to set up a camp just in case as a respawn point. Let's go turn you off. 
Boom, boom, and boom. It's not that I don't trust <laughs> that I won't die. I just know sometimes it's inevitable. And it has been a while since I played the game, so it more than likely is very inevitable. Okay. Can't go to sleep yet. All that's taken out. Uh, we got some fuel and everything. Yeah, and we got a motorbike just in case. I think I think we're set. I think we're set. We're going to go ahead and put this there too. And this. We're going to eat this first. I think this, this perish time is a lot shorter than that one. So, yep. We're going to take that. Okay. I think we're ready to go, guys. Alrighty. Yeah, we're ready to go. Oh, look, we could pick this stuff too. If we pick this fruit though, um, it might actually, Ooh, look at that dude. That's pretty dope. That's pretty dope. You know what? I'm going to pause right here and I'm going to get a screenshot of this. That is pretty cool. Oh, and if you don't know, press the pause button on your computer, uh, keyboard and it pauses the game. So I will be right back guys. All right, we're back. It's about to be dark in 25 seconds. So, let's go ahead and look around. Yeah, look at this. We get some natural stimulant. I'm going to pick the hell out of this place before we go. I like this too, man. What is this? Oh, it's just a regular fire. That is pretty cool. So I'm not sure I want to step foot in there yet um, because it's about to be dark. But this place is pretty legit. Can we go up here to the top of their pyramid? We sure can. The buried catacombs, huh? All right, so let's wait till it turns uh, turns light, which we're gonna go make that happen. This is why I brought the camp. All right, all right, it's early in the morning. Let's get over there and let's get this done. Okay, buried chamber. Let's get in there. Really, really cool. Really cool. Okay, I hear spiders. There's a hole in the wall there. Dottie Hottie's out. Okay, getting pretty close. Get the light on. Okay, be very vigilant. It's a giant snake right there. How do I safely get down there? That's what I want to know. Okay, so there's some catacombs down there. Looks like there's something up there. Can we put the jetpack on? We can get up there. Okay, cool. Alright, that's taken care of. I didn't think they thought I was going to come that way. <laughs> gotcha. Nice. Hopefully this stuff doesn't spoil by the time I get back up there. That's a spitter. That's a spitter. You know what? Oh yeah, you got me. Hitboxes, come on, get them. Good job. Okay, that definitely worked out better. Oh, it's storming up there too, bro. Spiders, you ain't got nothing on Chief. You know what went really good with this base? Snakes. I mean, hello. Kind of goes with the theme, right? Right downstairs. Spiders! Come on. Oh, I love it when we up. Perfect. You guys just make it too easy for me. 
Thanks. Uh oh. Those are some tough ones right there. No wonder the players didn't want to come. Ooh, Phoenix Fern. Yes, please. Okay, I still hear spiders. Spiky mushroom. Coffee. Okay, let's come over here. Seems like they're clipped too. Okay. Come over this way. Yeah, we'll grab your meat. Grab your meat too. Okay, I press shift F. Come on. Alright, this is definitely new. I'm definitely liking this. Let's see if those little spiders come around. They are not. Okay, we are here to loot. Nice. Uh oh. Lost my bearings. Ah, okay. uh, yeah, we're going to do a tactical reload on this one. Ooh. Ooh, yes, please, Mama. Mama, like. All right. We're probably going to have to get rid of something here soon. You know what? Let's go ahead and eat the cheeseburger. It's going to go bad soon anyways. All right, so we went over this way. All that's cleared. We went over that way. Is there something behind there? It looks like there might be. And there is. Oh, nice. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Uh, shotgun we can sell. Hmm. What don't... You know, we, I could get grain anywhere. I can't get that anywhere. I could sell this, though. Actually, we got a tier two. Uh, Sathium? Uh, yes, please. So we're going to be taking that with us. I feel like a Kua Berry Sprout. I'm going to keep that one. I got a Pumpkin Sprout. I got to always make more. We'll leave that there. Um, this guy we could sell. So we're going to take him too. Okay. That safe thing was, was better than the other one. Okay, we emptied all that out. We're good there. There's nothing else over here. I double checked. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on. So back up the stairs. Any hidden passages here? That's enclosed. Looks like there's something around here. Okay. That takes us down there. Okay, let's let's go. There she is. <laughs> okay. We can handle those spiders. I'm not worried about them. Come on. And more. Climb on the wall, huh? More of them. Alright, we'll leave them up. Oh! Good thing I had some situation awareness there, huh? Two for one. Almost another two for one. We might have to come back down here and grab some of this stuff. Is this destroyable? Don't know. Sure is. Better keep an eye out. Are we doing any damage? Let's check. No, we're not. Okay, it is not. Whoa! They respawn. Yeah. 
And three down. Okay. I believe there's probably some type of invisible spawner there. I'm not worried about meat no more. Let's just get what we came to and get out of here because this is just a spider spawn fest. There it is. Oh, we can take this though. Um, hmm. Lots of multi tools here. Okay, I gotta hurry up because let's leave the meat. Yep. Where's it at? Okay, this is the dead end over there too. So we gotta go back up the original way, huh? Is there anything over here? No, it's just decorations on the wall. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go up. I'm gonna go put everything in the... You know what, let's see what's over here first. Because it's something else, right? What's in here? Oh, luxury goods. Okay, yeah, we're definitely gonna... Because we could sell some of the stuff and get some money. Even though it's a tutorial, I like looting, bro. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna climb back up. And drop this stuff off in the HV. And then I'm gonna come back down and grab this stuff and we're gonna turn this quest in. How's that sound? That sounds great, Chief. Awesome, thanks man, I thought it was a good plan too. All right, Gaming Warrior, so we got done filling everything up. So obviously I came back up to the HV, went back down there, grabbed everything, and I also completely took all of the fruits and I made it back to my base and then came back here. <laughs> I just want to let you know because I don't want those things to go bad and spoil while I'm sitting here talking to uh, Kane Iden. Kane Iden. Okay, so let's go talk to him. Kane Iden. Den. Den. Okay, Kane Iden. Get some people just walking around here. Okay, well, they're bold. It's about to get nighttime. About to get nighttime, guys. I hate filming at night, too. It's so horrible. Horrible for me to see. I could only imagine what it's like for you guys. Okay, let's set it down. Let's go talk to the dude. Alrighty. If I remember how to get back up to him, which I think I do. Actually, he's down here. What am I doing? He's right downstairs, I believe. No. Yeah, he's right here. Okay. Did you find the technical artifact yet? Please come back when you did. Wait, I have it. Oh, I know what. I put in the HV. Dirt to dirt. Okay. There we go. Oh, he's a traitor. You, please. Hi, can I talk to you? He just gave me a thumbs down. Speak to contact again. Well, how do I how do I do that? I gotta go all the way back up there because I didn't have the technical artifact in my possession. Where the hell am I at now? He's right here, okay. Well, I heard you performed well. Caden Caden and Ad asked me to sign an honorable mention about your service. Seems like you have impressed him. Nothing not something achieved easily. Congratulations. Here. Got you a teleporter and an additional EVA boost module, module for your suit. You might need it when you go to space. But there's something important for you, Commander, to know. Our ships over the Elyon, El, Elyon system have yet to report about a single pilot that has this, that was spit out of the same anomaly, anomaly that brought your fleet to this galaxy. We are currently trying to make contact with our, uh, with our local force our local forces so he or she does not run into the same trap your fleet that your fleet into the same trap than your fleet 
Okay. I'm very confused. I'm sorry. I'm very horrible at this, guys. So if you don't like me speaking, you can go forward on this. I promise. I uh, I cannot scent. I cannot scent. That is wrong. I cannot scent this comm to your station as long as there is uh, there are Xerax troops around the communication communications blocked. But in case your you you speak to your commanders, please advise them to make the glad guys aware of your situation I assume we do not have the, uh, a lot of time things are coming in motion I can feel it affirmative okay so apparently other tasks I thought it what the hell's going on okay so apparently uh, I gave it to him or I didn't give it to him I don't know I don't know what happened there okay before you head back to the base, uh, we could take a look into the traders in the station, other settlements, building, sell the liquors and other commodity goods. Okay, we could do that. ATM. So let's take a look at the ATM. Ah, deposit this. That works. And we got a teleporter, so we can head back to base and use that. Um, info needed. I thought I gave it to him. Because I don't need it. I'm about to go back to him like, bro, bro, take this. Okay, so let me get the stuff that we need to sell. Let's see if we can sell this stuff. We're on the middle floor. Yes, we are. Oh, wait. No. We went too far down. Do, do you want this or no? Okay, whatever. I think this takes us outside. It does. Okay. So let's go up. Obviously, he doesn't want to keep that. So, whatevs. We want that. We want this. We want this. Tier 2 shotgun. Let's go ahead and upgrade to the tier 2 shotgun. And they could have this one. Um, I think that's really it. And we can sell the liquors too. Okay, so these guys are arguing. Don't want to talk to them. Alright, so this guy over he down here is a trader. Let's, let's go trade with him first. Let's see what he's got. Okay. I need all that stuff, so we're going to say no to you. I just want to sell. I'm not looking to buy anything currently. This guy's a trader. I know that much for sure. Okay. I should have brought those rocket rounds. Hmm. I don't think he bu uh No. He doesn't buy a regular shotgun. Just a tier two. I think. Yeah, I'm not gonna sell on my night vision. I'll tell you that much. Does he so, so, uh, Does he buy multi tools? He doesn't buy multi tools. He buy. He has multi. Okay. I got an EVA boost from that dude, so I'm not too worried about it. And I could put the multi boost on as well. Okay, so we got a trader up here. Let's see what he's got. Okay, so we could sell one. Perfect. That's money, money. And does he take multi-tools? He does. Sell. Wait, what? I got two of them. You took that one, though. Oh, okay. They take out of the, out of here, so you got to be careful about that. Okay, I don't want to buy. I just want to sell, but apparently he's not going to take another one. What else can I sell? It? Luxury goods? I could sell quantity three, maybe? Are, are you going to let me do quantity three? Oh, nope. I think he's only going to take one. How about two? Yeah. He'll take two. Okay. Uh, and liquors. What's the max he can do? I got six. Six? Okay, he can do that. Sweet. So I, I've i got a butt ton of money now. I've got a butt ton of money. So what do I want to do with that money? <laughs> that's, that's the great question here. Um, well, let, let's see. It says back to base. So let's go back to the base and see what we need. Uh, and then we could obviously... I saw another trader up there too. Let's uh, let's go upstairs. Look like a... Uh, okay, is there a trader in here? No, just food and I don't want to take anything because I'll get in trouble. Hold on. Hold on. Are you a trader? He is a trader. Let's see. Oh, he's got foods. Can I sell him regular meat? How about some eggs? Can I sell him some eggs? No, he doesn't want to take any of that. Can I sell him? I got... No, I don't... 
Oh, I, I think I put the water back in the HP. Okay. I don't want to sell him the water anyways. Okay, uh, we could come up here. I think that's... Yeah, that's the landing pad. What is this? Well, that's pretty cool looking. We don't want to go in there though. Okay. Uh, is, is, is this Krill guy a trader? He is. And man, I should have sold some of this stuff. We could always come back if we need to. And sell more. But I want to see... Ah! What am I doing? Okay. We want to come up here. And I know this... I know this guy's right here as a trader. Ooh, auto miner cores. And a flux coil. Hmm. And I think this takes us to outer space, right? Oh, we can't use it? Teleport to. You know what? I don't want to do it yet because we're... It's not like we're not in tutorial mode. <laughs> we're in tutorial mode. Let's do what it tells us to do, Chief. All right, guys. I'm going to go back to the base. Um, and yeah, I'll just cut to that. All right, guys. All right, we just got back at the base. I thought we were going to get back and I had time to at least make it go light before this happened. But here we got a teleporter. Probably escape from this planet. We should place it on the base. Important teleporters, as many other devices of this technical level, consume a lot of energy. When placing such a device, make sure that the energy output of your base is capable of handling the device. If it is not, you might damage the generators as they will run in overload mode to compensate for the missing energy out. This will lead to destruction of your generators within a few minutes. Okay, so we got to make sure that that is good to go. So, yeah. Definitely have to take a look at that. I think we only got one small generator, so we'll probably have to boost that up. All right. Uh, accessing a teleporter uh, will show you a range of available tar... Uh, tar... Targets? <laughs> faction status of target and distance, etc. You can teleport to any base you discovered as long as the faction is owned. It owns is the least friendly to you. You could teleport and uh, to and from your ship as long as it is not moving. You could teleport from a ship to a base as long as shields... As long as it shields activated or is under attack. As long as it has at shields activated or is under. That doesn't make sense. Okay, you cannot if the shields are up and it's under attack. Okay, so that's going to be kind of difficult in PvP. Uh, and you actually can teleport to a destination from the teleporter is off. Okay, so if the teleporter is off, you can still teleport there. Okay, that's cool. All right, so let's go ahead and get in there, and I'm going to make it daylight because this is crazy, and I don't like to uh, record in craziness because it's hard to see. All right, everyone, we're back, and it is currently daylight outside, and I'm currently taking a look at our power usage. So we're producing 2.6 KPU, and we're only consuming 0.4 KPU. So let's compare that to what the teleporter is going to need. Let's see. Uh, don't click on it. Okay, so it it uses 12 KPU. And we're only producing 0.2. That's a problem. Okay, so basically we're going to turn that on and we are going to overload our generator. Let's take a look at our generators. What can we produce All right, that will give us the KPUs we need? All right, so this is a small one we got. It produces 1.4, uh, that's the mass. It produces uh, 2.5. Okay, not good enough. We're going to need multiple of those. We are going to need a bigger one. So this is a T1, and it produces 25 KPU. So we need to unlock that. Do we have enough points? The tier one generator, and we do. Boom. We're probably, uh, I don't think we got enough for that one. We're probably going to need a bigger fuel tank, too. So we'll go ahead and unlock that one. Hmm. Rocket turrets. Let's just go with that for right now. Yeah, let's just go for that right now. Okay, and let's see if we could create it. No, we need cobalt alloy, flux coils, and titanium plates. 
Okay, so what do we need for all that? Nanotubes, steel plate, Sathium plates. Hmm. Titanium rods. We need titanium ore. Titanium plates. We need titanium. Okay, so we need to find another way to get this done. So let's go back and take a look at solar power. Okay, so we have one of these capacitors. And each one does what? It doesn't say. It just says placeable. <laughs> yeah, we know that. Thank you. Okay, so that just, I think that just gives us power. So we need to take a look at these then. Hmm. Efficiency, point one. Well, how come that tells me how much energy output it does? But this doesn't. Is, is there a difference? You know what, let's go actually take a look at what it's producing. I think we could do that in the P menu. Alright, so we got generator, solar panel, capacitor. Not really telling me. But I know it's doing something, but I think it's only given us one k uh, 0.1 KPU because the generator itself gives us five. So I don't think, unless we build an entire field full of solar panel, it's just gonna suck. So it's telling me to place it. Let's place it. I think we just turn it off. And we're gonna figure out the rest later. So I think there's a way for us to get that stuff later. So we're gonna place it. I think I'm gonna put it here in the little living quarters. Is it gonna let me? Oh yeah, just not under there. <laughs> okay, what needs to go? You? Oh, we're not taking the mini bar out. Can it go there? No, you know why? Cause that's in the way and so is that. Okay, well I'm not gonna interrupt my living quarters just for this. Um, And I don't think I could place it on the glass. I'm not gonna put it there. Oh, that's blocking the stairs though. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, we're just going to put it in here then. Turn the sucker around. Boom, done. CPU loader, your base just dropped below 100% efficiency. Open the P panel to switch to the CPU tab. Uh oh, here we go. Each block and block added to your structure reduces CPU efficiency. To check the requirements of the device, look, have a look at its hover. Info. Uh oh. So we gotta. We're gonna read this later. We gotta go and we gotta turn this uh, teleporter off. Turn it off. <laughs> okay. So yes, exactly what I thought was gonna happen happened. So we're gonna end it here. I think it's been a pretty long episode. Uh, we, we went and did a kind of like a, a little miniature P P U uh, P O I said P U I ooh poo. Anyways, uh, we did a little P U I. And it was pretty interesting. I've never done it before. It was pretty cool. Easy, but you know, you get the gist of it, right? You go in there, kill a lot of bad guys, take all the loot, get the hell out. Um, so, yeah, I think we had a good time. Well, you know what? We didn't see Vice President Pence. Where is he at? Is he here? Mr. Pence. Make your presence known, Mr. Pence. There he is. Hey, Vice President. How's it going? Good night. Okay, guys, that's all I got. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and add a CPU extender as soon as we come back. That's all I got. Chief Rocky out.